I got home from work early. Did I scare you? <laughs> no. You scaredy cat. How's dinner? Is it done? Almost. I'm starving. Let's go. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> Baby, you got something all over your face, and that was so worth it. <laughs> you do? Yeah. Did I, did I get it? Uh, uh, yeah, it's good enough. Okay. <sighs> wow. What's the occasion? Happy anniversary. I'm kidding. <laughs> Happy anniversary. Did you really think I'd forgotten? I don't know. Why don't you uh, close your eyes? Let's take out your hand. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Open them. Oh. Oh, it's a... Oh, it's... A rock. Oh, it's a tiny piece of the Alps. I'm gonna take you there on a trip next month, or uh, whenever, but there's this incredible climb. It's... Why does your face look like that? Um... What? I... I... What? I thought you were going to propose. Mel. <sighs> Five years, Carter. Five years we've been together and you don't even know that I hate heights. I thought it would be fun. Jeez, Mel, you used to run marathons. I used to dream I'd be able to keep up with you and now it's like... <laughs> what? I'm bored. Huh. You're bored? No, no. We're, we're happy. We're not happy? Oh my, Mel. Okay, you, you once blindfolded me and drove to San Francisco for dinner, and now you are literally making a roast. I, I, for you, for you. I have supported you for five years. Our entire relationship has always been defined by what you want. What do you want, Mel? I want to stop living in limbo. And if I seem lost to you from what I was, well, maybe that's because you've never given me any indication that this is going anywhere. Maybe you're right. Maybe this isn't going anywhere. What? No, I, I, I can't do this. And before you start feeling sorry for yourself, I want you to know that you are hurting me, by the way. Is that a fact? Yes. I still love you. What's my favorite color? <laughs> Blue. Get out.
It's been a week. Oh. Oh. oh, well, according to Cosmo's breakup calendar, this could take as long as two and a half years, so. Mm. Well, I don't have two and a half years, so I don't care what Cosmo's breakup calculator says. This is vile, wow. Well, it's good for you, so suck it up. Oh, you look so pretty in this photo. Leslie, you look pretty in every photo. Thanks. Mm -hmm. Well, so do you. I mean, you look amazing in these photos. So beautiful, you're strong, purposeful. Carter was dead weight. I know. You get to decide who you want to be. Not him, not anybody else, okay? I know, I know, but he was right, though. He was, I've just, I've become so small. It's like I don't even know who I am anymore, who I was. Okay, well, who you were was not perfect, but she wasn't, you know, drinking wine at 4 p.m., house hunting down memory lane. Oh, okay, fine, I will indulge you for one minute. You look gorgeous in this photo. Hmm. Who took that? It wasn't me. It's probably one of the thousands of guys who are madly in love with you. R yeah, please. <laughs> All right, listen, you beautiful sad sack. Here's what we're gonna do. You're gonna get off the couch. You're gonna put away those scrapbooks. You're gonna stop listening to Boney Bear's early work and you're gonna come to the gym with me. No, I hate the gym. You're a track and field record holder. You do not hate the gym. Yeah, I, that was in college and I do hate the gym. They're like playgrounds that are not fun. Well then make it fun. Bring a friend, enter me. No more wasting time. No more wasting time. Cheers. You are going to love this place. I sincerely doubt that. What? It's, it's very exclusive. Exclusive like expensive? No, it's like the place to be. It's where all the rich guys work out. Hi, how's it going? Um, could I please have one guest pass? Yeah. Oh, Amy, I didn't even recognize you. Hey. Hi. <laughs> How are the kids? Great. Good. Oh, you guys changed your logo. It's so much better than the last one. The last one's like a little chintzy. Totally That's agree. cute. So fun, right? To the right, to the left, to the left. Rocky, rocky. Nope. Okay. Okay, Mel? Sorry, I didn't mean to scare you. How did you know my name? I, uh, I saw your name on the guest list when your friend signed you in. Oh, right, right. I'm Trey. I'm one of the trainers here. Right, nice to meet you. You too. How you doing? You doing okay? Yeah. Yeah, no, I just feel a little out of my depth. Look, I remember my first time here. I was so nervous, I nearly had a panic attack. <laughs> and uh, believe me, you're in much better shape than I was. Thank you. You're welcome. Listen, I need for you to have a bad first impression of the gym. Can I offer you a free session? There's no strings attached, I promise. Uh, I don't know. No pressure. Um. Why don't you just make yourself comfortable and I'll get you a bottle of water. 
Okay. Yeah? Yeah, thank you. You're welcome. OMG. Who is that? He's a trainer. He offered me a free session. Hmm. Um, yes. A thousand times yes. You should obviously train with him and, you know, sleep with him, get married, maybe have his Wait, children. No, 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 no. I just got out of a serious relationship like five minutes ago. Anyway, I don't think he's attracted to me. Oh. Oh. Okay. Yeah. Your radar is clearly broken, so I'm gonna go. But, uh, you enjoy your training session. This is the sparring area. Excellent cardio, a lot more fun than the elliptical. You don't mind me asking what brought you to the gym in the first place? My excruciatingly upbeat friend. <laughs> yeah, I saw her. Yeah, and my stupid ex. Oh, exes. Yeah. Okay, so we will definitely be using this area. <laughs> Yes. yes. <laughs> Come on, a lot more to see, so follow me. One more. Come on, you got this. You got this. Stay focused. Good. <laughs> Excellent work. Good job. Thanks. So, how do you feel? Good. Good. Good, yeah, surprised. I didn't expect to be signing up for gym membership and definitely not personal training. Well, you will not be disappointed. I promise. Thank you for encouraging me. You're welcome. Tell you what, just sign right there. That's it. Congratulations, Miss Barrett. You are officially a card-carrying gym member. <laughs> Yay! There you are. Oh, hey. Hi. Okay. Don't gloat. I just signed up for a personal training package. Nice. And Trey's my trainer. Very nice. People must tell you all the time that you look familiar. I did a uh, community charity calendar last year, so that's probably it. <laughs> I'll be Googling that later. <laughs> uh, tell you what, why don't you come back in tomorrow morning and we'll do all your intro procedures and stuff. I promise it's not as scary as it sounds. It was very nice to meet you. Leslie. Yes, that's right. Bye. Hey. You were so lucky. I'm oh. just, I'm so proud of you. It's okay. It's a gym membership, not a Pulitzer. Yeah, but you did it and you're doing something. You're creating something and your new trainer is hot. <laughs> Don't be weird. Well, not noticing would be weird. Well, it's a professional thing, so if anything, his vibe will be like a brother. Yeah, an extremely hot brother who's not related to you. <laughs> okay. In that case, I think you should date him. Do not tempt me. <laughs> I got you an extra set. Thank you, Chloe. Excellent. Go ahead and take a break. Mm -hmm. Do you see anything you like? Absolutely. Yeah, this is a nice piece. Yeah. Antonio Gutierrez. He's young, totally bizarre. A genius. It's called Chrysalis. You can see the rough alternating layers to the paint. Coherence, but the texture's a bit of a riot. The artist says he believes in error because beauty is not found not in... Not perfection, but the artistry of imperfection. You know his work. Yes. The artist graduated from his MFA program a month ago. Mm -hmm. You just let me babble on like I was introducing him to you. Like you just wandered in off the street. I did just wander in off the street, but yes, I know his work. I was just enjoying watching you do yours. How mad am I, by the way? Melissa. Melissa. Pleasure. Hopefully I'll see you around here again. You can count on it. I own the gallery. Don't look so scared. All this assessment intro stuff, 
is for you to track your results moving forward, okay? So let me uh, grab a quick picture. Uh -huh. <laughs> Sorry, it's a, it's a progress photo. All of that before and after nonsense. You don't have to do it if you don't want to. Are you going to post it? I keep them in a photo album, in a bin, in my desk. No one's ever gonna see them, okay? Okay. Okay? Two seconds, ready? Great. Easy. Okay. So uh, let's, let's talk about your fitness goals. You got any? Ever since I was a little girl, I've wanted to do a pull-up without any help. Unassisted. Yes, but, but then where you push yourself all the way up so you're completely upright. A muscle up. It's a very epic move. Only 1% of people are actually capable of doing that move. Oh, wow. Wow. Okay. A muscle up. I love it. Okay, so we have the perfect goal. Now we need to set a date. I recommend six weeks. It's ambitious, but if you are willing to commit, I think we can do it. Six weeks. Okay. Okay. I'm 100% committed, whatever it will take to reach my goal. Yeah? Yeah. Excellent. I'm excited. Let's do it. All right, so the way this works is that you are going to do a pull-up just how you normally would. <laughs> just like normal? Yes. Uh-huh, okay. It's been a while. Uh, like 10 years. 10 yeah. years, good, okay. So the machine is going to help by supplementing your weight. It's gonna make it easier. Easier? Yes. Easier, okay. Are you ready? Whoops, yeah. You're good, let's give it a go. <laughs> That's all right, that's supposed to happen. It's supposed to happen? Yes. Okay. All right, now as you pull up, shoulder blades back, and you're squeezing a tennis ball right there. You feel that? Yeah. All right, go. Good. Okay, good. Let's try one more. All right? Okay. Good. Okay. That was a great first attempt, all right? You're not gonna be perfect right out of the gate. And eventually, I'll get you on that. Are you kidding me? That's a skyscraper. Yes, it is. Oh. And believe me, you will do it. All right? Oh. Let's try again. Okay. Get up there. Okay. Oh, okay. Squeeze. I'm Wonder Woman. Good. So, your goal, a muscle up, mm -hmm. is basically two parts. First part, the pull ups we just did. It's your biceps, your lats, your trapezius, Everything else. Second part, mainly triceps, which dips are the perfect exercise for that. Set your water down. Okay. And let's go to town. Okay. There we go. All right, go for it. Good, good. Okay, you straighten your arms, shoulders forward, chin down. Good. Can you do one more? <laughs> yes. Good. Good. Breathe. Excellent work, my girl. And because you've done such a tremendous job, I got you something. It's a fitness tracker. <laughs> wow. Can I be him? That's, that's amazing, but I... Don't worry, it's covered by the initiation fee, all right? This tracks your calories, it tracks your sleeping pattern, how much you walk, so... That's for you. If you give me your phone, I can set it up for you. That's really nice of you. Thank you so much. You're so welcome. You wanna do some cardio? Do I have a choice? Absolutely not. Then I'll do it. That's my girl. Hey. Hey. 
I think I've hit a wall. Yeah? Yeah. How far'd you run? Uh, maybe 10 minutes, maybe. 10 minutes? Maybe. Okay. There's your phone back. Thank you. You're welcome. So let's uh, get you out of here. Yes, please. <laughs> hey. <laughs> hey. Hi. Hey, how was your workout? It's great. Really? <laughs> Hi, Trey. So I scouted out some of the local talent for you. What do you think about that guy? I think his name is Mark and he's in marketing or something. Mm -hmm. Oh, Mark in marketing? Oh, what, like Trey and training? <laughs> I think you should ask him out. Um, I'm here to work. That's my girl. Good job, killer. Thank you. I'll trade you. Uh, do this. Thank you. You're welcome. Wait a minute. What's wrong? Is there matcha in this? Yeah. Is that okay? It's perfect. <laughs> I used to drink these obsessively when I was training in college. Really? Yeah, I thought I was the only person who knew about matcha and protein. It's delicious, right? It's totally. Mm -hmm. Oh, takes me back. So good. So, what's the deal with this X? No offense, but I do not think you are the right confidant for this sort of thing. Ow. No, I just, I think that you've probably never been dumped. Oh no, I've, I've been dumped. Can we tell you the first story? Yes, I do, because I do not believe you. Okay. When I was in high school, I had a crush on this girl. Um, so I went to pick her up at her house, and when I got there, there was a post-it note on her door that just said no. Oh, you must have been hideous. <laughs> oh, yeah, laugh it I up. Know. Okay, okay, so Carter, Carter broke up, well, the thing about Carter is that I told him that after five years, he still didn't know me at, at all. I mean, he did, but he didn't care. I am deathly afraid of heights, and he wanted us to go climbing in the Alps. That's bad. What? I don't... I have an idea. Mm, what is that? Are you up for a field trip? I don't... It's right next door. I don't trust that Say yes. Guy. Okay. Let's go. Okay. 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 Now, I was saving this for later in your training, but... I think you need it now. It's great for building grip strength, upper body strength, and you know... Facing your demons. <laughs> Listen. You're stronger than you think you are, okay? But we don't have to do this if you're not comfortable. No, I want to. Are you sure? Uh-huh. Okay. Let's do it. You look great. Good. You look great. I can't do this? Yes, you can. No, I can't. Yes, you can. I don't want to hear that. No. You got this, Mel. I will not let you fall, all right? You want to reach the top? Yes. OK, climb. Listen to my voice, my voice only. I believe in you, Mel. You got this. I will not let you fall. Oh, OK. Good job. Oh, I can't breathe. Hey. I can't breathe. I can't breathe. Hey, relax, OK? Take it one handhold at a time. You got this. Um, have you seen Mel? Sorry, she's, she's probably old. with Trey. They're next door. At the climbing wall? Yes, that's right. Oh, 
Okay. All right. I believe in you. You got no. this. Okay. <laughs> Breathe. You got this, Mel. Okay? Listen to my voice. My voice only, okay? okay. Come on, Mel. You got this. Okay. Good. Uh, oh. That's her safety. Bring her down, Trey, right now. I can. I believe in you, Mel, okay? She has to do it now. You got this, Mel. I believe in you. Okay? Reach that top. One more. Okay. You got this, Mel. I believe in you. Okay. Yeah. Woo! Good job, Mel. You did it. He could have killed no, you. He knew I could do it. I was safe the whole time. Okay, he guessed you could do it. Thanks for the vote of confidence. Well, he gambled with your life. I'm sorry, how do you not see how irresponsible that was? You were the one who wanted me to take more risks. Yeah, smart risks, not ridiculous, silly, life-threatening risks. That was not silly. That was important for me. I've been afraid of heights my entire life, and I just did something about it. In the most dangerous way possible. Trey knew I could do it. He believed in me. Why can't you? No one believes in you more than I do, okay? You're my best friend. I love you. But I just, I care about you and I don't want you to get hurt, okay? I'm sorry I scared you. Sorry I was kind of a bitch about it. Hello again. Welcome back. Thank you. So I've been thinking a lot about the last time I was here. Oh. Yeah. I mean, some things are just too beautiful to forget. I like to buy it. It's chrysalis. Of course, yes. I'll just look it up. So, it needs to stay on the wall until after the exhibition is over, but I will have it delivered after. Actually, I'd prefer to pick it up. I, uh, can't stop thinking about the gallery owner. Well, there's a closing night party on the 15th. You're welcome to come. Mm -hmm. Loved it, but I think I have a dinner on the 15th, so I'm not sure I'd make it. Uh, what time does it end? 10. That actually works. <laughs> <laughs> and when are you free? Uh, how about Saturday? Eight? All right. It's a date. <laughs> Leslie? Hey, babe. I'm so sorry to bug you. It's not about your hot day, though I expect details later. Naturally. What's going on? I got a flat and I'm supposed to be at the office like yesterday. Do you think I could trouble you for a ride? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Um, hang on. Sure. Yeah. No sweat. You're a legend. I'll see you soon. Okay. Bye. Bye. Okay, if you can pull yourself away from the electronics for a second, we have arrived. Well, to say thank you, I jailbroke your phone and made all the little icons into little flowers. Oh, wow, that's so invasive. <laughs> thank you, my little tech friend. You are so welcome. <laughs> well, I am so sorry that I made you late. I'm sure Trey will be merciful. All right, see ya. Just clear all the mats in the Hey, okay. I am so sorry I'm late. What happened? Oh, Leslie just needed a ride to work. Something with her car. What? Nothing. Come on, let's get started. No, no, what is it? It's just, I've, I've kind of seen this thing before. 
know, someone starts to make progress and people that have been supporting them, they just start to derail them in small ways. I don't know. No, I don't think that's what's happening. <laughs> no, I'm sure you're right. Here, before we get started, I, uh, I got you a little something. What is this? Just open it. It's a key to the gym, kind of like your home away from home. A lot of the clients have them. It's kind of like a, it's like a rite of passage. That is so cool. Thank you. You're welcome. Ready to get started? Yeah. Come on. Let's go. Let's do it. Did I tell you you look stunning? Yes, you did. Mm. But thank you again. <laughs> So, do you want to tell me why a great guy like you didn't already have a date on a Saturday night? Well, actually, I recently broke up with someone. Yeah, I kind of sworn off dating there for a while until I met you. Do you want to talk about it? Nothing to talk about, really. I feel like she didn't really know me after three years of being together. No. How about you? Same. About five years. He thought my favorite color was blue. Yeah. Purple, right? Yeah, you've worn a little piece of it with every outfit I've seen you in so far. I had a really good time tonight. Yeah, I I did too. Thank you. I really did. I want to see you again. Ditto. Tired girl. What, late night? <laughs> yes, I had a date. Good. One more. That's my girl. So, this date, anything serious? I hope so. I'm seeing him again on Saturday. Wow. Yeah. Saturday. <laughs> it's moving a little fast, no? I don't know. I think when you see something you want, you, you go for it, right? Right. Thanks. Oh. See you next time. I think this one. Yeah, let's go with this one. I'm stalking you. In broad daylight at my place of business? Brilliant. <laughs> so what time you finished here? Ah, uh, never. No, we just got this new collection and I'm... I'm freaking out. Oh. Can I help? How much do you know about modern silver gelatin prints? I could bring you takeout. <laughs> well, I can't. Training diet. I can cook for you. Something healthy. You gotta eat. Okay. I mean, it might be late. Perfect. How'd you learn how to do that? Well, my mother passed away when I was a kid, but... Not before she taught me how to cook. I'm sorry. She must have been very special. Yeah, she was. She really knew her way around the kitchen, and uh, she had your sense of style. What about you? How'd you, uh, how'd you get into fine art? Well, I ran track in college, so I wanted an easy major. Art, art history? <laughs> <laughs> yes. 
Yeah, and then I ended up loving it. So, I was living in Brooklyn after college wearing a lot of black. Sexy. <laughs> and I started working as an assistant in this hole-in-the-wall gallery. I worked my way up to curator. There really wasn't a lot else you could do with an art history degree. I mean, unless you have a lot of money and can become a major collector, which I just didn't. <laughs> but no offense to you. None taken. I mean, the only reason why I have money to collect is because I started collecting. How did you get started? Well, yeah, my father was a man who believed in what he could touch, what he could understand. He didn't believe in art or music or any of that nonsense. Hmm. Anyway, when I was nine and wanted piano lessons, he uh, gave me a subscription to Forbes. <laughs> oh. Exactly my reaction. Mm. So anyway, when he passed, he left me a little bit of money. I used it to buy an early Bonasari. My favorite. Yeah. Yeah. So why'd you keep collecting after you made your point? I fell in love. It's gonna get cold. I think I'm okay with that. That's my reminder alarm. I'm late. Training? Yeah. Yeah, my trainer's a bit of a stickler. Mm -hmm. Well, maybe I should meet you at the gym sometime for a workout. Protect okay. you from the stickler. I'll hold you to that. Hey, you can hold me anytime. <laughs> you like that? Uh-huh. <laughs> mm. Good morning. Morning. Mm, I need to go. Yeah, I can't believe you're turning down the possibility of a brunch. You are so strong. I am so strong. Talk soon? Oh, yeah. Make plans? Absolutely. You're not getting rid of me that easily. Don't get too buff. <laughs> That's right, you believe in the beauty of imperfection. Mm -hmm. Hey, Melissa. You are perfect. Hey! Uh, Trey, you scared me. What are you doing here? Uh, you weren't on time, so I figured you might like a nice walk to the gym this morning. Okay. Yeah? Cool. Sure. Let's go? Yeah. Oh, here. Made that for you. Thank you. Okay. Hey, Melissa, you forgot your phone.
Adam, this is Trey. Trey, this is Adam. Oh, yeah. Heard so much about you. Nice to meet you. About to be mutual, I'm sure. Well, I should get going. Uh, door's locked. Enjoy your workout. Thanks. It's nice to meet you, man. Yeah, you too. Take care of her for me. <laughs> Should we go? Definitely. Uh, I'm sorry. I know I keep talking about Adam. All right, you're lagging, hon. Come on. Sorry. No, it's not just that he's incredibly good looking or, or that he's well educated. He's just. He's like, he's like nobody I've ever met before. Okay, we're gonna pick up the pace. Okay. Come on, come on. Okay. There we go. And he, he cooks. He's an amazing cook. He's an amazing cook. I'm, uh, I'm gonna get you a bottle of water. Okay. I'm so glad you guys got to meet. Me too. It's just so amazing. Bill, can you hear me? Hey, there she is. Welcome back, beautiful. Did you carry me here? Of course I did. You scared me passing out like that. Sorry. No, you have nothing to be sorry about. Sometimes you hit a couple of unexpected bumps on the road to success. You okay now? Yeah. Yeah, I think I'm, I'm okay. I'm good. Okay. Hey. You know I will never let anything happen to you. Ever. Right? Okay. Tell you what, won't you uh, sit here for another minute and I'll get some more ice water on this. Okay. Good job. You just dropped? Yeah. Well, you have been getting a lot of cardio lately. <laughs> hmm. So, tell me about Art Boy. Well, actually, he hasn't really called in a, a what? In like an hour? No, in a while. I mean, Ugh, you've always been so clueless about your admirers. What admirers? In college, you had the entire track team on lockdown because of your legs. And then there were the art geeks. And then there was that guy. Who's that guy with the, um, hearts? The, the, the hearts guy. What? The construction paper hearts guy. He was like, he was like that, that weird, shy guy, big guy. Come on, what was his name? I don't, I don't remember, I don't know. What? He would leave heart-shaped notes under our dorm room door, like, every day. Hmm. I can't believe you don't remember his name. Ugh. I have to go. Hmm? 
What? It's early. Well, I have to go make dinner and catalog the new exhibit, which will take hours, mind you. And then, I don't know, I have to train in the morning. So, yeah. And you can stand to miss one day. What? Just stop it. I have to train. Oh my God. You are obsessed with training. Well, maybe you're obsessed with derailing me. What? I'm the one who brought you to the gym in the first place, remember? Yeah, I do remember. And now I'm getting back in shape, and I'm dating again, and you're over it. Are you serious? I can't believe you would say something like that. Because you don't seem to understand that I have to train. Because your fitness goals are not the gravitational anchor around which my world spins. You know, Trey said you would do this. Oh, what? Trey? You mean Trey who showed up at your house like a crazy person, Trey? Sure, yeah, no, listen to him. Not your best friend. Totally cool. Hey. Hey, you're here early. I was just finishing up some stuff. Oh, no worries. You mind putting this in the cubby for me? Of course not. I'll be out in the field. Thanks. You're welcome. Breathe. Keep your breath normal. Here, let me show you. Step down. Okay. Okay, it's two parts, remember? So imagine you're pulling the bar to you. When you get up, press up, all right? And use your momentum. The view's great up here. You're gonna love it. All truly good things take time, Mel. You okay? Mm-hmm. You'll get there, I promise. Talk to me. Yeah, no, it's, it's not just that. I had a fight with Leslie. I basically accused her of sabotaging me. Is she? I don't know. I mean, She's always been there for me. I don't... Like when she was there for you with Carter. When things weren't going well. Yeah. Yeah. And now you're kicking ass at the gym. Now you're seeing this guy. Adam. Right. Yeah. Adam. And you are strong as hell right now. In my experience, friends want their friends to succeed. They just don't want them to surpass them. My advice is you take a 24-hour detox from Leslie. All right? Just see how you feel. Trust me. Trey, please come to the reception area. Trey? Hey. Hey. Trey, right? Yeah. Come on in. 
Shut the door behind you. Sorry to uh, walk and talk about my mid-workout. Yeah, yeah, no problem. It's pretty early. What brings you by, man? I'm here to see Mel. Is she around? No. <laughs> this place even open? No. Not for another half hour. Mel has a key, though. She said she'd meet me here, so... <clears throat> maybe she forgot? Yeah, maybe. Her phone doesn't seem to be working. <sighs> if you like, I can tell you stop by. Yeah, thank you. I'd appreciate that. Yeah. <clears throat> well, uh, just gonna head on out. You know what I love about this place? <clears throat> it's science. <sighs> it's numbers. <clears throat> it's math. <sighs> Here you dedicate yourself, put your mind to it, you can achieve whatever you want. <clears throat> Doesn't matter what you're born with. Here, perfection is a mathematical certainty. Okay. Of course I heard you're more of an art guy. Yeah, I am. You wanna do a superset? Yeah. Why not? <clears throat> ah. Leave. I'll spot you. Yeah. Gonna crack some tools, man. Take the bar. Hmm? The bar. Sorry, man. Uh, music. I didn't hear you. Idiot. You ready? Mm hmm. Okay. So, what you want to remember is that your attacker will most likely be larger than you. Okay. Okay? So get a good, strong base. Sure with the part? Okay. Good. How's that feel? Yeah, feels good. Good. Okay. Now, with my arm, I'm gonna reach around right under your throat. Okay? Keep your hips back. All right? Very important to stay as close to your attacker as possible. It minimizes their counter options, all right? And with my arm, I'm gonna go under your arm, Grab the back of your neck. Lock out right there. Good. Oh. Got a piece of hair. Good. You're doing great. Now, I can grab the back of your neck. You feel that? Uh-huh. Okay, good. With this arm. Alright. Be to grab the back of my head. Good. Good. 
Now the next move is to slowly turn out. Got it. Yeah, I got it. What's going on? Is it Leslie again? No, I took your advice. It's good. Just haven't heard from Adam. I'm sure he'll call. And look, if he doesn't, crazy. Ready to go again? Actually, do you mind if we just call it a day? No. Of course not. Hey, bro. Yeah, no worries, I can help. Hello? 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 Who is this? Adam? Hey! We don't have a session today. Do you want to get another workout in? No, I've been thinking about it and I, I, I think I need some time away from the gym. Why don't we just do a last weigh in? You know, check your stats, see your progress. We'll see where you're at. Five minutes, I promise. How was your weekend? It was good. Yeah. Did you have fun? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Hmm. What's your diet been like? Pretty normal. You gained a pound. Have you been taking the supplements I gave you? Yes. I forgot yesterday I got busy. No, 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 no. Do you know what happens to the body when you ease off, even for a minute? It's a pound. It's a shortcoming. I'm gonna go. No, wait. Hey, 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 hey. I'm sorry, okay? I believe in you. You are so close to perfect. I just want to help you get there. That's it. I need a break. Let me out, Trey. No. I can't let you do that, okay? Interrupting your progress at this point can be... can be very dangerous. Get out of my way. Thank you.
I need you. Thank you so much for your help last night, Leslie. And thank you for getting the comfort food, because... Carter. What are you doing here? Just stopped by to get my last box of stuff. Wow. You, uh... You look incredible. Thanks. Why didn't you call? I figured you'd be at work. I went in last night, and I found that someone had broken in and trashed the gallery, so... Sorry to hear that. Thanks. Yeah, I filed a police report and an insurance claim, but I can't really do anything until the cleanup crews are gone. Ah, uh, sure. Yeah. You should probably give me your key. Yeah, yeah. So you home alone? Yes. Who else would be here? <laughs> Your new boyfriend? I know you didn't text me. What are you talking about? Your psychotic new boyfriend. You know, actually, I shouldn't even be talking to you. Who are you talking about? Adam? I don't know his name. He said some pretty vile stuff. Like what? Well, aside from jamming body parts into other body parts to basically stay away from you. <laughs> what? Oh, look, Mel, I'm happy to see you. And honestly, you look incredible. But tell your demented new boy toy if he texts me again, I'm calling the police. Carter. Hey. Carter. Leslie. What is he doing here? Come in. So Carter said he got some crazy weird texts from me, but I didn't send them. I didn't send anything. Well, you are lucky that I am a technological genius. I am so lucky. I say it every morning like a mantra. Ha ha. All right. Oh, boy. Yoza. Where is your laptop in this mess? Keep digging. OK, here it is. OK. <clears throat> Okay, so if someone were sending Carter weird texts... I'll oh. find out who. Just let a master work. And I also need to remember Carter's number because I blocked it out when he dumped you. <laughs> Me too. Bingo. Take a look at this. <gasps> wow, how'd you do that? That's like magic. Eh, more like advanced computer science. So, yeah, magic. Is that even legal? Oh, jeez. Okay, so what are we looking at? Carter's incoming texts. This is the longest one. Super creepy, and there are tons just like this from the exact same number. Whose? Yours. So who would have access to your phone? I mean, nobody. It's always locked up at work, at the gym. Think. Um, Adam? OK, let's call him. Uh, OK, well, you call him, because every time I call him, it just cuts off, and I don't know what's up, so. It's blocked. What? It's blocked. He blocked you. That doesn't make any sense. Look, I'm sure you were amazing in bed, but he definitely blocked you. No, I mean... Well, if, if he doesn't want anything to do with me, then... Wow. But if... Why would he go to the trouble of texting Carter from my phone? Look, I know you don't like getting any flack for Wonder Boy at the gym, but he would have access to your phone. OK, I admit that Trey's been weird lately, actually very weird, but I mean, he 
changed my life. No, you changed your life. Okay, so let's go check out the gym and do a little reconnaissance. Okay, shoot. I can't, I have that closing exhibit reception at the gallery tonight. I have to go down there and make sure I can even pull it off with all the vandalism. You're still doing that? I mean, I have to. What am I gonna do, just lose more money on it? Good point, good point. Okay, so while you get ready for that, I will see what I can find out at the gym and then we will meet back up at the gallery party tonight. Okay. Just one thing. What are you writing? Instructions for a backdoor IP assault. There are so many texts, it seems unlikely that this person only texted from your phone. I mean, if they used a computer app to connect at any point, and if they didn't reroute through a VPN, you can track them. Okay, this is like a foreign language to me, but thanks. Great. Oh, and uh, no, it's not legal. I know you guys are closing really soon, but I wanted to know if I could use your sauna mm -hmm. really quick. Great. Go on home, man. Cool. I'll look up. to volunteer to do recon. Oh wow, of course he has a photo of himself in his desk. <sighs> okay, Trey, what do we got? Pills, check. Okay, what do we got here? Let's see, bingo. Okay, boring. Huh. X-ray, boring, boring. Well, hello there. Okay. Oh. Trey. Trey is lunch tray. Leslie, where are you? Call me back. Bye-bye. Okay. <sighs> Come on. Hey, you've reached uh. Leslie. Let's see here. Back door, IP assault. 
IP address is the gym. Okay, that's weird. Fitness tracker app. Hey, Mel? Melissa? Hey, Melissa? Leslie? Mm. Mm. Leslie? Are you in here? Mm. Mm. Leslie?
How do I... You forgot this. What? No. What? Why are you scared of me, Mel? Sit. No. He forced you to sleep with him. I know he did. I can make him dead, not just hurt. Please, sit. <clears throat> Sweet Mel. <laughs> I'm never going to let anyone hurt you. Ever again. It's me. <laughs> Your secret admirer. We were in love. In college, remember? But we couldn't be a couple because you were you. And I... Well... Things weren't perfect. Stop! You always have been a shy one. Hey, it's okay. You can't imagine what it was like to be so lonely. Wanting you all of these years. But of course, before we can be a couple, we have to be alone. Never! Why are you hiding from me, Mel? Do not make this very easy. All right, Mel, it's your choice. Back to Adam it is. Look at you. You think Mel could ever be yours? You'll never have what we have. I remember the first moment I fell for her. Fall for me now. It's over. It's over. Can you walk? No. Okay, no, come on. Good. Come on. Oh. Okay. It's okay. It's okay. Mm. It's okay. It's okay. Run. No. Get the hell off me. I think you can choose him. You're mine, Melissa. Forever, forever and always. 
Mm. It's me and you, baby. That's it. Okay. Oh. 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 I know I've told you this before, but beautiful job on the restoration. I mean, you can hardly believe anything even happened here. Oh, thank you, I know. Well, you guys did such a fantastic job too. I mean, my security system can now rival NASA. Oh, I will take that. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so, uh, you got five years, huh? Can we not talk about Trey? You're right. Old news, old news. To you and this beautiful gallery. Cheers. Cheers. Hey, sweetie. Hey, gorgeous. Oh. Brought you some flowers. Thank you. And your mail's there, too. Oh, thank you. Ooh, ooh, oops. <laughs> What is this? Don't freak out. It's an everyday thing. You're not concerned? Not in the least. Mm-hmm.